Hi everyone and welcome to Iris Mastery Series. My name is Daniel. I'm the CEO and founder of Iris and today we start to go a little bit more technical and I'm going to show you my screen. So the question today is how to remove blue light and before I show you basically to explain you need to remove all blue light because it has negative effects on your on your eye health. It causes a lot of eye problems like macular degeneration, cataracts and all, all other kinds of bad stuff. It also changes our circadian rhythm, so it's good to remove it at night at least. But I have contacts with a lot of eye doctors and a lot of other kinds of doctors which told me that, and there are actually medical researches about this, that you need to also block blue light during the day. Okay, the reason for this is because during the night it changes your sleep patterns, but during the day it's like UV light. And you know that the sun has negative effects on our eyes, and this is why we wear sunglasses when we go outside to block the UV light. But the truth is that blue light is really close to the UV light and other harmful rays to our body, like X rays, gamma rays, and things like this. And this is why, as the most high energy light, it's good to block it also during the day. Because the LED monitors spike at, uh, at the blue. And there is a lot, a lot of emission of blue light from our monitors. We need to somehow block it, at least a little. And this is why Iris, even during the day, it's uh, with reduced blue light. So, to show you, I'm going to put myself outside of the screen. <laughs> To, to show you this series and if you want to remove all blue light you can basically the easiest way is to open iris from here right and click sleep so right now all blue light is removed from from my screen uh, same thing with biohacker i think but with core inversion so you probably don't need this but health mode is to to get new users used to the program, but if you want to remove all blue light, uh, click sleep on. And if this is too much, I recommend going to the advanced settings and from the blue light page, you can control the blue light with the sliders and try to lower it day after day by a little until you get to somewhere like here during the day and somewhere here during the night. I'm not sure, but this value basically removes all blue light. But like here, we remove also the green pixel of the backlight, which also remove, uh, which also emits a little bit of blue light. So if you go here, you're perfectly safe. But some monitors should remove all blue light with values like here. Okay, so one way from the simple settings, click sleep type and this removes all blue light and the second way is from the blue light page just control with the sliders you can use one value during the entire day with manual light or you can control these things separately and there is also some something else this is the sleep type uh, the sleep transition iris has three types of transition during the day during the night and during late at night because during late at night, you probably need a little bit more reduction. The default values are good, so you don't need to worry about this. But if you want to use the third transition or to not use it, click it from here. And you, you see the time where the, where the third transition is active. And you can change all these things. So sleep type or from here, blue light and sleep tab, sleep page. <laughs> Thank you very much.